guys, as fans tailgate tours, put it in your calendars, put it in your put it in your your planners, whatever it is. S fan tailgate tours episode zero, the pilot episode. I need your guys' help. It is going to be this Saturday. I have done everything I possibly can to, to go into that thing, ready to go. I, I'm confident about it. It's going to be good, but I want your guys' help. I need like feedback on, hey, what do you guys think we should do? Maybe some ideas for like different segments. I want it to be like an actual show. Saturday, I'm going to go live at probably 11 p.m. Central Time. I think I'm gonna go live at 11 p.m. Central Time. It's gonna be a two to three hour stream. Yeah, put it in your Palm Pilot, write it in your school planners, tell your teachers, tell your moms. I'm I'm very, very excited about S-Fans Tailgate Tours. I think it is gonna be huge. Gotta go to a &M? I will. We are gonna go to UCLA this weekend. UCLA, they are playing Hawaii at the Rose Bowl. I believe, yes. So if you are going to the UCLA game, you may see me out there. But what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do is, oh, 11 a.m. Did I say p.m.? I meant a.m. 11 a.m. I'm so used to saying p.m. 11 a.m. Central time. It's going to be good. They're at the Rose Bowl, aren't they? Wait, let me check this out. Hawaii versus UCLA. Yeah, Pasadena. Pasadena, California. <laughs> you know what's funny? <laughs> I was like, wait a second. I went to the right Metroplex. That's what they're called, right? Metroplex. I was like, I I am going to the right Metroplex of California, right? <laughs> will this show be sponsored? It will not be sponsored. I'm open to getting sponsors for it, but this is a this is an S fan production. Okay, me and Finn are going out there. It's gonna be good. Did you ever go to the hospital with COVID or did you stay home? I, I stayed, well, actually I went to emergency care uh, the night that I started feeling bad. The day that I started feeling bad, went to emergency care and I was like, yo, let's get tested. Let's get whatever. Boom, 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 boom. I got everything checked out, good to go. And then they gave me like prednisone because I have asthma. They, they were like really aggressive with it. And I, I, yeah, I can't stream the actual game. I can't stream the actual game, but this weekend we are going to Los Angeles. I got to talk to some guys and see if maybe, maybe we'll have a guest join us for the, for the show. I can't stream the actual game itself. Very, very excited, dude. Todd Graham will be in his second season with Hawaii. Wait, I didn't know Todd Graham is at Hawaii. Dude, Todd Graham is a Texas high school football coach. Where did Todd Graham coach Texas high school football? Was he at Allen high school? He was Allen high school. Cool. That's crazy. Todd Graham. Uh, are you going to watch the game? No, I'm not going to watch the game on stream, but before the game, we are going to go around and look at the different tailgates, kind of show the atmosphere of college football. This is going to be something that I do kind of weekly. It's going to be semi-weekly, not bi-weekly, but semi-weekly. So I'm going to do it almost every week of the season. We might have some weeks where we take an off week, maybe maybe two or three times uh, during the season that we take a week off. Kaiser will do a cooking stream with us fan. Kaiser will lives in Hawaii. Do you fly to LA or are you out there right now? No, I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to fly to LA. Can you show inside the stadium like before the game? I don't think I can get into the stadium with a backpack unless I have like some kind of whatever. Now that would be a cool experience and maybe that's something I can do at a, at a school where I have like some relationships there like SMU where I go and I show off the facilities and stuff before the game. I think that'd be cool. Or I live in California. I used to live in Hawaii. Wait, really? Kaiser Bowl? Wait, Kaiser Bowl, are you going to be there? Are you going to the, uh, are, are you going to the game? Kaiser Bowl has the pass. He's allowed to snipe me and say, hey, it's a trek. I might make it. Oh, I mean, if it's, if it's too much you, you fans, shouldn't, but love you kaiser bowl has a pass uh come out to an osu game it's nuts here in columbus yeah i mean we'll see what happens i mean this is not gonna be a one-year thing i'm not planning on this being a one-year thing i'm planning on if this goes well this season this being a a, a show that we do every single season that is that is my long-term plan i don't know how that's gonna go i'll evaluate it at the end of the season but this is something that i want to do long term i'm very very like excited about s fans tailgate tours we have a special intro screen on the I, I look i may i got an irl intro screen made for it okay that's how serious i am about this you've seen my irl stream have you guys seen my irl stream intro screens have you guys seen the see how seen how bad it is but we're gonna we got a good one actually a pretty good one so psycho chaos thank you for the four months I'm very, very excited. Very, very excited about S-Fans tailgate tours. So Saturday, I'm planning on going live at 11 a.m., maybe a little bit earlier, maybe later. Isn't it just repeated clips? Uh, yes. I hope this gives background for a future partnership. I mean, I hope so too. I mean, if we can get a spot. This is a very, very, very expensive sort of thing that I'm doing. Man. This is a very, very expensive sort of thing that I'm doing. And I'm, I'm, I'm putting a lot into it. I'm very, very passionate about it. So... And I like IRL is expensive in general. I know how everybody knows how IRL goes, right? If you're if you're like a Twitch frog, you know you know how IRL is. I'm hoping I can get some funding and stuff. I, I'm gonna chill on streaming WoW on my main channel for the most part. Uh, I'm not gonna stream it very. much. I mean, I already haven't been streaming it very much, right? People want to act like I stream WoW 12 hours a day. I mean, it was only for a month, right? Where I'm I'm like, whenever there's new content that comes out, I'm going to do it. But 
uh, on on my main. As much as I love love Burning Crusade, man, I'm just gonna do some other stuff until uh, like you didn't even look at, at this. Like for the last like what? If you look at the last month. Like just chatting 36 hours, Madden, Madden 22 alone. I mean, not including whenever we're playing Madden 21 has more hours than WoW. Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy still has more hours than everything, even though I haven't played it in like two weeks minus yesterday. It, it, it just, it is what it is, right? Like uh, whenever they come out with tier five, we'll do a little bit more WoW and, and this and that. Uh, right now, I'm not particularly super interested in in playing, in, in, in doing a lot of WoW stuff on screen or on stream. So I don't usually like the backseat suggest skins. The club game called Operation Tango that I think would be fun to watch you and a guest play for a one-off operation tango how long is it 14 is good don't get me wrong 14 is good and fun yesterday man i was just like kind of like i just wasn't feeling it man i was, I was exhausted part of that is just everything else going on and and whatever so i, I played for a little bit and then and then we moved on man, I, um, actually i gotta I, I realized that recap has gone a little bit longer than normal um the last two days so I, i'm gonna do some more 14 stuff and then we have our classic wild raid night and then uh and then i might play some madden or maybe do do mario or something afterwards i want to go to bed at a decent time so that i can go live a little bit early tomorrow for football thursday i want to go live like my time that i want to go live is noon central time like six hours ago is whenever I want to go live. Recently, it's been really, really, really bad. And I've had real life and I've had this and everybody understands, I get it. It's also not good. But tomorrow, I want to go live before noon if I can, because I'm going to go on Austin's stream for, for Lover Host with Minx. And then, uh, so that'll be fun. Like it's, that show is, is I, I love doing Lover Host because it just lets me like basically be a goofball the whole time. And then, uh, and then I'll come back for more. I, I'm going to stream twice tomorrow. And then I may or may not stream Friday. I don't know. If I stream Friday, I will stream very early and then saturday will be the show listen I, I really really appreciate how supportive you guys have been like this has been like a very rough month stream wise and youtube wise and pretty much everything right just trying to get everything like with with real life handled it's kind of this weird this weird thing with twitch and and content creation and youtube it's like it's it's hard to like step away and do real life stuff especially if like i don't know there's like a whole thing but people have been like really supportive and uh very very positive towards it and and uh there's times where like i kind of stress myself out and i and i and i run myself ragged, wear myself thin. So um, I, I really do appreciate like the kind messages and, and people being in chat and people still enjoying the streams. Cause uh, I kind of have this like, uh, this like perfectionist sort of like, I'm always trying to like do everything the best I can. And I, and I have a tendency to like, uh, feel like I'm a little bit living up to my own standards sometimes. And it kind of puts me in this little like loop where, where I, I don't feel very good. It really does help whenever, whenever people have been supportive and, and people are excited about stuff and whenever you can kind of see, see that, you know, it's, it's kind of hard to, it's not something that's very tangible. It's, it's, it's not like a tangible thing in some ways it is, but in other ways it's, it's not. And, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of rambling a little bit. It, it does mean a lot to me that, that people have been so supportive. Um, at least you guys, you know, and, and I have friends who've been very supportive too, right? Like, like Miz and Nick and, and whatnot. So I really do appreciate that. You're one of the best streamers on Twitch and one of the few I can tolerate watching. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Foodway. Why do you said that standard? It's just how I operate. Can't do anything about it. It's just how my brain works. Uh, let's take a look at my summary.